Welcome to my channel. Today I have a Shein haul or Shane Shin. I don't know how to say it and I feel like everyone says it differently so whatever. But this is my second big haul from Shein and the first time I ordered stuff everything fit. I love everything so much and I had a whole list of stuff that I liked and I dove in and made another order with the high hopes of everything fitting again because you know I did my measurement and all these other clothes fit really well. I'll have the other video linked down below if you're curious but there are some clothes that I really really love and some clothes that I'm kind of like meh about and then there's some that are just epic fails like why did I even think that was gonna look cute it doesn't fit I don't feel comfortable and it just looks weird so <laughs> I need you guys to help with me on this so we're just gonna dive in to this whole haul okay <laughs> are the first things that I really like bell bottoms. I like the wash, I like the holes, but for some reason, my thigh right here, I don't know if you can tell, but it's super tight, like right in the middle of my thighs. And then it's like super baggy right here, but fits perfectly fine around the waist. It's also very baggy below the butt area and I'll find the picture for you guys but what it looked like online was not like this at all and I'm 5'10 so it's really hard to find pants that are long enough and I really like that these were long enough but this is just no <laughs> no so I'm gonna be returning these because I feel like this part just looks so awkward. I feel like I could deal with like the bagginess in the back, but because it's so tight on my thighs right here and so baggy in this area, I just feel really awkward with this whole situation here. Hopefully you guys can tell they had so much potential. There's gonna be a lot of like up and down angles but I mean this I thought would be pretty cute and I do like this tank top a lot I feel like I don't have a lot of tank tops I'm not really the type of person that likes to show my stomach too much um but I do like that this has a higher neckline which I do like and it does cover like most of my bras yeah I kind of like this style I like the lavender. I feel like I could do something with this. So this one is a win. These are a no. This is the next outfit. I've been loving seeing these kind of outfits on Instagram and I thought I could pull it off, but it just makes me feel super uncomfortable. I feel like I'm way too tall to pull this off. Um, it shows a bit of stomach if I pull it down and it is quite short and this little slit makes me very uncomfortable. Also the top is big and the fabric just seems very thin in general. So this one is a no. It's really cute on some people. I just don't think I can pull it off and I just don't feel myself and I don't trust the fabric of this, but I mean, the back is pretty cute. It's pretty cute. I feel like it look cute on someone that has this style, but I can't pull it off. Okay, this is the next outfit. I am obsessed with this tennis skirt. I need it in every single color known to man. I think this tennis skirt is super cute. It has little pockets on the side. It has shorts, so, you know, it can be short and you're not going to be 
showing anything, try and put it down a little bit more, but I think this is so cute. I feel very cute and girly, but sporty, and I got a little spot for my phone or whatever, and on both sides, and yeah, I already worn this twice, and I'm definitely getting more colors of this. I am a bit indifferent about this top. I don't really know. I don't have any like white tank tops, but as you guys can probably see, it is a bit see-through, but I thought it'd be nice to have just like a plain white tank top like this in my wardrobe because I like it and I don't like it. I have a lot of clothes that are high-waisted because this is a cropped like halter tank top. Let me show you guys the back. So I would have to move my bra straps, but I mean like, this is a pretty cute outfit. I like it. I just don't know how I feel about the tank top. But overall, you guys are looking for cute tennis skirts, 100% recommend these. I will try my best to link them down below because they are the best absolutely the best okay this outfit is cute but i'm a little indifferent about it because like i want to pull the shorts down because i am a bit conservative and i feel like you know if i bend over everything is getting seen so i mean i like the shorts by themselves but with the top and the shorts together. I just feel like I just wanna like be like this. <laughs> just my personality. Um, but this top with some jeans I think looks really cute. And I have worn these shorts with a different top and I did really like it. So this outfit is kind of 50-50 because I don't like the outfit but I like the individual pieces. It did get a bit wrinkly in the wash. Side note, it wasn't as wrinkly when I got it and wore it the first time. But, you know, being 5'10", uh, wearing shorts as short as this, you kind of feel a little like, <laughs> everyone can see me. I am extremely uncomfortable with this outfit. It's kind of like that plaid outfit. I had the same thoughts of it, of seeing everybody with this kind of style. And I just don't think it fits me. But I do like it individually, like the other outfit. Like I like this skirt. It is a really thick, stretchy material that I feel like I could dress this skirt up with like some flannels in the fall a nice cream color this top with it I don't think I could ever wear this as an outfit I feel like I would like it as like a lounging bra or just like a top or something cute kind of like a bralette style underneath a shirt but this I don't have the guts to wear out in public <laughs> and while I'm at it, I just wanted to show you guys this bathing suit because, I don't know, I'm wearing all these outfits makes me a bit uncomfortable <laughs> to where I'm not comfortable with myself. But I did get another high-waisted bathing suit top and bottom that I thought was really cute. I mean, like, even this I feel like is a little bit better with each other the skirt that like kind of covers up a little bit more. I'm one of those people that's like, you either show only tummy, like you show one thing is what I'm comfortable with. Like you show arms or your stomach or your legs and this shows everything. And I, I just never been a person that's comfortable with that. But yeah, I love this bathing suit. I'm just not comfortable trying it on right now and this outfit I'm gonna keep like the last one but just not style it in this way this 
this is freaking cute okay this is a whole one piece like tennis outfit with like shorts and they do have the pockets and if you do play tennis you just put the tennis ball in your pockets but if you don't then you can just plug your phone in there but this outfit i feel super attractive in super comfortable i typically wouldn't wear a bra with this type of outfit but it's super super comfortable super easy and i mean like it's just so freaking cute i love the back detailing on here i mean if i didn't have a bra and I feel like it would look a lot cuter but this one is 100% a win and I need to get back into tennis because I need to wear this somewhere because I mean like this is just too cute not to wear anywhere I don't know what to say about this I'm gonna tilt the camera down maybe a little bit more okay so these are at a very awkward length on my legs and I just feel like I look really awkward in these pants like this part is like weirdly baggy it has like a weird stretchy but tight material uh I don't know I hate everything about these pants super uncomfortable not myself so I'm definitely returning these. This shirt, on the other hand, I thought I liked, but I really don't know. It really digs into the armpit area. I feel like I would need a size bigger because it's just really tight on even behind the armpit and in front, and it gets a little tight on my neck, but I do love the color of it. And I have no idea what this says, but I like the style that this has. These pants? No. 100% no. No, no, no. I typically would not wear these together, but both of these just fit really awkwardly on me. These sleeves are a little bit too short for my liking, and I just... I like the color, but the style is just not really my thing. And it looked a lot better on the model than it did on me. These shorts, I feel like fit pretty nicely around the waistline. But as you guys can see, they're just way, way, way too baggy. Like they are so baggy around my legs but the waistline fits super good i don't understand so both of these are no i like these shorts i just don't like how they fit i feel like if they were like just a tad bit tighter somewhere they, i would really like these but they're just so incredible incredibly baggy that I just can't wear them. Let's start with these pants. They are at a pretty awkward length on my ankles and I just don't feel comfortable when pants are like these. I do like the fabric of these. Um, they're pretty tight around the waistline but they're really flowing baggy on the legs so it just feels a little uneven and I don't like the length, so I'm not a fan of these. Though I do like the color, and I like the style. I just wish the sizing was a little bit more proportion, proportioned. This, like, sweater, I love this. I love the peekaboo shoulders on either side, and I do really like the neckline, and it's just a plain gray sweater. So I feel like this would be nice to have. Since fall is around the corner, I am on the hunt for fall stuff. So yeah, this is a nice like medium thickness fabric, warm, but kind of showy for the fall season. So this is a winner. 
returning these. Okay, I don't know how I'm gonna get all of this in frame, but this is super heavy, first off. It is super comfortable. It feels like pajamas, and I absolutely love that. I am a little weirded out by the little tie. I feel like I could have gone a size smaller, but I feel like if I went a size smaller, I wouldn't like where the sleeves are. So I'm having a little bit of a dilemma with the waistline of what to do here to make it look as cute as possible. I don't know, but for fall, I feel like this outfit is super cute. Once I figure out how to properly dress this. This one is a maybe, because I haven't made up my mind on it, because I don't, I really don't like the fabric of this. It feels very cheap and just like, I don't, I don't know how to describe it. The overall look of this, besides wrinkles, is really cute. The elastic around the arms is very, very tight, and I don't like that. <clears throat> I don't know. If I had somewhere where I'd actually wear this often, I would probably consider keeping it, but it's more so on the not list because I just am not in love with it. It came pretty wrinkly. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think of this one because I just can't decide if I should keep it or return it because I really wish you guys could feel just how thin this material really is. And this is like cutting off the circulation of my arms. All right, this is, an, this is another one that I am just, it looks way cuter on the app than I feel like it does on me, is the fabric feels very strange. It has like no give. So every time I move my arms, I feel like the Incredible Hulk and I'm just gonna like rip through this. Also, it has a very weird way of putting it on. There's a zipper right here and then you have to, you know, adjust this thing and these buttons are not adjustable. They're sewn in and I don't really like the crinkly bottom of this dress. I don't know. It's just, I had a thought and now I don't want the thought of wearing this because I just feel so strange. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take me like 10 minutes to get this back off of me. So yeah, I'm never gonna put this back on again. Okay, this is the last outfit and I am not a fan. I'm kind of a fan of the top just because it's a pretty thick and stretchy fabric. Though I don't really know where realistically I would actually wear something like this if it wouldn't be like underneath a different top. The skirt, I hate. It feels like it just doesn't want to move at all. And I like really flowy skirts. And from the pictures, this did look pretty flowy but it is a very thick fabric. It also does not have any other shorts underneath it. So that's an issue. It also is see-through. I did get two colors of this. I got it in a light pink and this white, and I just do not like the way that it feels on my body. I do like the more athletic wear fabric for these types of skirts. And this is just almost like jeans and I really don't like it, but I don't really know how I feel about the top. I kind of like the top and I kind of hate the top. All right, and that is everything for my Shein haul. Unfortunately, I had more stuff that I did not like, 
than I did absolutely love. So that is a con, but I do like that I'm trying out things that are a little bit different just to try it out. You never know if you don't try it. So let me know what you guys thought of everything down in the comments. And if you guys want to watch my last Shein haul, I'll have that video right over here for you guys. This video will be suggested to you by YouTube and my face will be right here where you click on it and subscribe to my channel.